Hey, what's going on, YouTube? This is Eternal Havoc here with episode 10 of my Epic Brawls of Tamriel series. And I must say, this weather rather fits the mood. Because I suppose it's not that bad. But I ended up recording an entire episode, probably around 20 minutes, or maybe 15 to 20 minutes. And Fraps didn't seem to want to record any of my voice. But I suppose not too terribly important things happened. Um, I can pretty much run through it. First of all, I have Lydia now, but I was pretty close to that point anyways. Um, I actually did clear that area out um, on my first try even with Lydia's help. And it wasn't that difficult. And during that raid, I leveled up and I chose a perk in the little Grandmaster thing. I chose like Little Dragon or whatever it was that increased your unarmed damage by 20%. So, yeah. Whoa. Am I fist glowing? What the hell? Okay, I'm... Maybe that perk did something else. Maybe it did something that I didn't realize it did. Here's his unarmed attack damage. Unarmed incoming damage is reduced. Shield appears at low health. Jumping four times within five seconds when wearing no armor provides a shield. Interesting. One, two, three, four. But obviously I'm wearing armor, so. Alright then. Let us continue on with our journey to Ivarstead. Or, yeah, I think that's it. So... Yeah. Let's roll. As you can see, I'm not lying. All these guys really are dead. Because otherwise they would be shooting me right now. There's a dead body. Don't think I've looted him. Take his arrows, his gold, his lockpick, his mead. But yeah, nothing real, ex nothing real big on my loot here. Just a few little things here and there. Um... Banded Iron Shield, I can give that to Lydia. She'll she'll appreciate it. Lydia. Ah, no, talk. Alright, um... I kind of explored some of the UFO in that video, but not really sure what I, I did. To carry your yes, you are, Lydia, so just be quiet. I'm giving you a new shield, so just be happy. Yes, I agree. Alright, moving on. I am assuming that I just continued down this road. Not entirely sure, because this is place is on the other side of a mountain, so I can't just follow my marker. Come on, stride out down the hill. Stride out. Jump. Leap. Run. Something. Come on. People in this game are both in amazing shape and terrible shape. I mean, they can fight guys as long as they don't use power attacks for however the hell long they want. And yet they can't run 100 feet in armor. Downhill. But, you know, that's the way it works, I suppose. Alright, run. I mean, okay, so maybe it's more than 100 feet. But still, you should be able to run longer than that if you can fight for days on end without food. And not to mention that they have a pretty amazing vertical jump. It's like Minecraft. I mean, seriously, every single person in the world can jump three feet in the air. Pigs can jump three feet in the air. That is not normal. Oh, look, there's something on my radar. Come on. I bet it's a wolf. I'm feeling wolf. Or a mud crab. Might be a... Wow. Nope, it's a wolf. Yeah. Get on. Search you. Take your pelt. Even though it does not actually take your pelt. Which, honestly, is kind of nice. Don't want randomly skinned wolves everywhere. That would be really creepy. That'd be kind of interesting, though. If, like, to actually take their pelts, you had to um, get a knife and actually skin them. Oh, look, what are these guys doing? Just walking. If you know any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to Windhelm. Well, I would like to, but I don't have time. I'm doing other things right now. Let's see. Am I on the right way to Evarstead? Ah, stop it. Okay. 
Um, yeah, I am. I gotta kind of continue down this river. Alright. I'm sick of eating rabbit? Well, you could be eating goat legs like me. Because I... Yeah, right. I was... God, that's gonna be terrible. I feel so bad. I almost want to go back through and re-commentate over it, but that'd be even worse. Because I'm terrible at non-live commentating. It would be incredibly boring. I wouldn't be talking most of the time, and you guys would be like... God, this is terrible. Uh, I'm gonna get your rabbit. Nope. Dang, these rabbits are fast. Oh my god, did it seriously survive? What the hell? Oh my god, it survived. I gotta... Ah, bad rabbit. Get back here. Silly rabbit. My punches are for your face. Wait, what? Yeah! Now you did. Alright, there we go. A raw rabbit leg. Amazing. Alright. How's Lydia doing? Nah, she'll be fine. She'll be fine. She'll catch up someday. Someday, Lydia will find me. No, that was just terrible. I'm just gonna stop now. Oh, look, a wolf. Yeah. Get owned, wolf. Can I not loot you? Whatevs. Harvest that flower. Oh, look, who's this guy? Oh, I know who this is. This is the random bard, dude. He's, like, incredibly strong, because I think I tried to kill him once. Oh my god, he's a speechcraft trainer. Okay, slowly turn. Alright. He's a speechcraft trainer. Well, after a little incident with a roguish lad and uh, the daughter of a prominent thane. Whoa. Well, let's just say person. Afraid not. Huh. But if you're serious about sharpening... Bard's the College time, in Solitude? The Bard's College in Solitude. Huh. I may have to do that. That seems like my kind of place. Alright. So... Also on our list of things to do, join the Barge College. We have so much stuff to do. Because we have to do Elizweir, we have to do the main quest, we have to join the Stormcloaks, we have to do all the guilds, we have to join Bart's College. Bart's? How about Bards? Um, alright. Ah, too many things. Oh, what am I doing? I don't even know. Alright, bring it on, wolf. Lydia, are you using a bow? Why? Your archery's terrible. I learned that last episode. But you guys didn't see it. I'm sorry. I truly am. I feel terrible about that, but... You know, we're just gonna have to deal with it. Something that we're all going to have to live with. Alright. This has been an incredibly boring episode. What is up with all the stuff that's not doing anything at all? I'm just going to sprint at this goat and punch it. Ah! I mean, seriously, like, the most exciting thing we've done this episode is try and kill a rabbit. Nice shot. Jeez, look at that. She hit it right in between the leg from clear back there, uphill, while I was punching it, and she didn't hit me. That's pretty impressive, Lydia. I will admit. Why did my Grandmaster increase from sprinting? I don't know. I think it's actually just a little bit delayed. You know, how, like, after I punch stuff, it'll, like, wait, like, a minute or whatever to actually update. So, I'm assuming that's what it is, because it's had some seriously random updates. I don't know. Maybe it's something that'll be fixed in the future. Hopefully. But... Honestly, if that's just what it is, it's not that big of a deal. But it might be nice to work all those bugs out. Alright. Ivarstead. Up here. Ah, what is up with that symbol right by the S? It is like trees on a arch. What is up with all the wolves, too? Come get me! Dang it, rock joint! I don't want you. I wonder if I have any cure disease potions. 
Nope. Well, that's lame. Ah, <sighs> diseases, diseases, diseases. That's what I liked about being a werewolf. You never contracted any diseases. And it didn't actually really give you that many negative effects. And if you ever wanted to, you could just go transform into a werewolf and just sprint for like ever. Come on, Lydia, I'm being mauled by wolves here. Alright, fine, I'll use a freaking potion on wolves, that's pathetic. But... Alright, good. Okay. Wolf pelt. Wolf pelt. Garnet? What the hell is a wolf doing with a garnet? Does it be eaten jewelry? Strange. Very strange. Anyways... This has, hasn't has been the most exciting of episodes, but really neither was the last one. We're just kind of at a boring point right now while we're working on starting the main quest and just working on getting everywhere. So hopefully future episodes will be more exciting. They should be because once we actually start getting into the main quest and we start getting our cooler shouts and things. Speaking of which, I should really rebind my shout key. Did I rebind my shout key? I don't know. Because it was Z, wasn't it? I don't know. Is it Q now? E? Maybe? R? No, not R. F? Nope. Um, Alright, well, anyways, I'll figure out what my shout key is. But in the meantime, see ya, YouTube. This has been Eternal Havoc. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Do all that stuff. It really helps me out. It really makes me want to make these videos even more than I already do. Because I love making the videos, but I love your support even more. So, I shall leave you with this amazing Skyrim sunset. I think it's sunset. I don't know. It might just be like high noon or whatever. But yeah, enjoy the scenery, YouTube. See ya!